What's up guys? I just wanted to make this quick video to show you guys how to properly install the Slimline modded ES3 blade. So just open this up, remove the extra guide plate, put that on the side. Remove the blade out the box. Make sure before you place it on the trimmer, make sure that the blade is in fact truly zero gap and it's not overbiting or overlapping. Make sure that both blades are, are at exactly the same level. That way it's, it's at its closest setting. So we can see here, you guys can always use something as a background to kind of differentiate the, the contrast, the contrast in colors. That way you guys can see if the teeth are aligned perfectly. That looks good right there. Okay, so now we insert this little groove here. We insert it here in this, in this, uh, in the trimmer drive that drives the blade back and forth. Okay, so now we want to begin by placing one screw in first. Okay, simply screw that in. Make sure that when you screw it in, you don't leave it tight but snug because if you leave it too tight sometimes since since this ceramic um, motion blade is actually lighter than the steel blade it's going to stop it from moving and it's just gonna stay still it's not even gonna move so make sure again unscrewing it just to show you guys that I'm screwing it in and leaving it snug okay now grab the other screw Go ahead and put that in. Make sure that when it's, it's nice and snug, you can go ahead and then push up, push up here in the blade. If you want, you can screw, unscrew this one a little bit, loosen it up, and then you can see this blade going back and up and down. Make sure that it's all the way up. I'm pressing, I'm putting pressure here with my thumb, making sure that the, the stationary blade is all the way up to the highest to the highest level that I can get with these uh, screws. So unscrewing the unscrewing these in, loosening these just a bit. Okay. Now go ahead and screw that in. Snug. Screw the left one in. Snug. Sometimes you're gonna have to go in a little bit tighter. Tight here. Tight right there. Okay. Now you should have a nice hitting blade. Upside down and upside up. Ready. Ready to ready to start getting to work. Okay, so that's it for the video and I'll see you guys on the next one.